Hello, Park House Academy and Artagogo friends. Today we're doing things a little bit differently. We are having a virtual art show. The first piece I'm going to show you is one of my favorites. It's called Waterfall. It was inspired by Annika Yi, and this has been up on our walls here at the Park House Academy for about two years. And that was a collaborative piece inspired by Annika Yi and water. If we move off to our left, this is something that's very special. This was created this year, also inspired by water. It's called Blue Tide. It was made from recycled blue jeans, donated yarn down at the bottom. And if you look at the detail up close, that those are recycled white plastic bags from the grocery store. So that's very cool. We're gonna continue our tour here. And we have some fifth grade illustrations and you can see they are beautiful. We have watches and sunglasses and paintbrushes and turtles, light bulbs, more sunglasses, frogs, bottles of glue. They even made bottles of glue really special. So we used pointillism and stippling and watercolor to make these um, really special just by using black ink and white paper. If we continue on, kindergarten mixed media, look at all of that color. They are really special. We used watercolor and gold paint to make our colors really pop out. So I would have these hanging in my house. Maybe I'll steal them. I don't know. What do you think? <laughs> Again, kindergarten. And then we're going to walk around here to first grade. These were black and white cut paper flower designs. I just love them. They're very bold and graphic. And some of our friends took a simpler approach with just one or two stems or no matter how they created their art, they look amazing. So you don't even need color to make your artwork special. Black and white is fantastic. Now this Coming up next, I wanted to show everyone this. This is our world, which is a little bit broken and um, makes me very sad, but everything that's going on in the world, um, we will make this better. Our goal next year is to recreate this and put our world back together. So I thought that was very symbolic. I hope you agree. So next year, that's what we're doing, friends. Third, fourth, and fifth grade clay. With these grades, our third, fourth, and fifth graders have the freedom to create whatever they want in clay. So that was Sophia, um, Sophia Mata's um, clay right there, and Harrison's cactus, and we have a teapot, Sophia's teapot. Grayson's clock, very cool. Lily's llama, Parker, very cool with your coiled pot. And we have, look at that guys, it's a telephone, an old fashioned telephone. Beautiful trees, Presley's pot with that lid. Landon, look at that boat. Everyone just did a phenomenal job with their clay. The glazing's amazing. The form and function of these pieces is crazy good, guys. Be proud. Look at that cute triangular. Um, Walker did that. That was really neat. Um, oh, and the taco with the salsa. Alley, yum, yum. It's lunchtime. I want to have some of that. But just really special. And I love the fact that we had that freedom with our clay. So 
second grade self-portraits we always have to do our self-portraits aria amelia lachlan dylan look at the colors william isabel and isabel beautiful and the highwayman was a focus with, with our afternoon art class pink skies like a sunset sky just really cool and here's a selection of illustrations ricky and grayson and we did um, some aboriginal dot paintings Anderson, that's a lower division student. That's pretty crazy. Crazy good. And Giada's lemon. And buoys. I'm gonna bring it up here. Here's some more fifth grade artwork. Quinn's tape. And Tristan's lock. Rishi and Elise. Just saying these names makes me miss you even more. I hope you enjoyed the virtual art show. Normally we have everything up on the walls and we have elegant music playing. We do have that today. But today it's just me and your beautiful artwork. So hopefully you've grabbed a snack and a cold drink and maybe you can look at this over and over again, try and find your artwork. And I hope you enjoy. Be safe everyone. And we'll see you next year. Love you. Bye.